Are you ready? Hey guys, we got sent these super cool hair ties called the Snappy Likes a Curl Scent and I think these things are pretty awesome. I love that it has like a little button like to snap off out of the hair because it makes things so much easier and I'm going to show you um, later in the video how I do that. And if you check out these super cool colors we got, they have other colors as well but I like these girly colors. And I'm just showing you right here how it comes off and how you snap it back on, which is pretty cool. So I'm going to use these two colors in her hair. And I am right now just doing pigtails. So if you don't know how to do pigtails or you need some help doing some pigtails, click on the link I'm going to put in this video to um, the tutorial that I did on, the pig on how to do pigtails. So I'm just showing you another way that you can use the snappy when putting a ponytail in her hair. It's pretty much like putting one of those ball elastics in her hair, just you know, taking it and wrapping it around and around until you get to the end and just with this one you're gonna snap it right on. I prefer the other way better but you know, some people might like this way. So I've already started style number one which is two cute little braids. I love this style. Um, hey, if you don't know how to do braids, uh, I'll put a link in the description box to my tutorial, my step-by-step -step tutorial on how to do braids. It's super simple, super easy. If you just practice, you'll get it. But anyways, I love this uh, when we're going to parties. If it's a, I need a quick do, bam, cutie. If you want to make it even super cuter, add a couple little breaths on the bottom. The next hairstyle is this braided bun. You just need to keep those braids in and grab a couple of elastics and twist it up in the bun. I would watch what kind of elastics that you would use because as you can see, you can see those white elastics in there. I'd probably use like a black pair of elastics if I was going to be going taking her out in this. I like it. I like it a lot. So this next one, I call it the braided loop. Um, what you want to do is just take that braid and loop it and then put an elastic over it to hold it in place. You can also just stick that braid under that other elastic, the one that's already placed there in the ponytail. And I think that would work perfectly fine, but I'm just taking that elastic. And I again, you want to watch the elastic that you use because again, you can see that black there. And I think it's just so cute. Now we're on to the next style and this one is the twist. It's super easy. You're just going to take two parts and you're going to twist them around and I do it really tight just to get a nice cute little twist. So as you can see I'm just grabbing my comb and combing the ends to make it nice and clean and we're gonna do the other side. And I think this is one of those styles that you would do if you need something really simple and cute because she's going to a birthday party or something like that. This is it. Ooh, this one's my favorite, the sock pigtails. 
anybody can do this just get an old pair of socks I'm using my husband's old socks they're almost holy holes in them as you can see so all you do is take them cut the bottoms off the toes part and you're just gonna fold it and fold it into like uh, I don't know a thick bracelet uh, just I don't even know what to call this but you fold it into that and I'm doing it to the next one just follow along <laughs> So I'm just going to take this little sock bracelet and put it over her ponytail and I'm going to make sure that it is all combed out and moisturized and I'm just going to spread it all the way over that sock bracelet and even it all out and yeah just watch how I'm doing it here. And I just have to apologize I'm trying my best not to sniff but I have a cold and my nose is running like crazy but I had to get this video out because I promised I would get a video out every Thursday and Sunday um, if you didn't know but yes that's why I'm making sure but okay if you notice I just tucked the rest of that hair underneath the bun and I'm gonna show you again on this side a couple of different ways you can do it So here I'm just going to take those pieces that are out and I'm just twisting them and I could do a better twist but I'm doing it fast for the purpose of this tutorial and it would look really cute if you make it a nice twist. And I just tuck that end piece right under that bun. So now on this side, just like the other side, I'm just tucking it under the hair or under the bun and then what I'm going to do you'll see I'm gonna get an elastic just to secure it tightly even more and my gosh don't you just love this I love it and now I'm going to show you how cool and easy it is to take off the snappy I just unsnapped it and I didn't even expect it to come off so fast like watch see Wow, that was pretty cool. And watch how cool the other one comes off. So easy, so simple. Yeah, I, I really like this. So now for this next set of styles in y'all yeah, pigtails, I am going to just create some bangs here. And if you notice, I'm using the middle of her eye as a guide as to where that end and beginning part on the sides are going to be. So for this next style, uh, it's just super simple, super easy. It's just leaving the bangs out all nice and cute and fluffed out along with those pigtails. It just really goes and it looks so cute. I love it. it is perfect for any occasion now for this next style you want to kind of have her hair pretty moist and you grab your wide tooth comb and you're just gonna twist and twist and twist into a nice cute little ringlet you're gonna twist the bangs and I'm gonna also do the ponytails if you want to learn how to do ringlets cute little ringlets I'm going to put a link in the description box for that and yeah this is the next style. I like it a lot. So yeah, like I said, you just want to make sure that the hair is pretty moist when you're doing these ringlets because it's going to make it easier to get that comb through and easier to manage. And I'm just doing the same ringlet on the other side. When I say I have her hair moist, you can see the moistness all coming out of her hair. <laughs> 
for some added cuteness, I'm going to add this bow to the bang ringlet. Love it. So as you can see, I have her pigtails back in braids because I wanted to take this bang and put a braid in it and I thought that it just goes with the style. So I'm just putting a little braid in the bang, it's so easy. Like I said, if you want to know how to do a braid, I will put a link in the description box to my step-by-step -step tutorial on how to do a braid. It's easy peasy. And again, just going to add a bow for some cuteness. For this next pigtail style, I'm calling it the fluff ball and I'm just putting it back in this snappy and uh, before the last loop, I am just going to put it through halfway like I did right there. And there you go, uh, fluff ball! <laughs> and I'm going to do the same to the next side. And how blessed are our daughters to have this beautiful fluffy hair that they can put in these cute little, look at cute little balls and they just fluff up and they look so adorable. Finally, we're at hairstyle number 10. Thank you so much for sticking with me through this whole video. This is like my longest video ever. And yeah, the, the last one is the bubble pony. Um, so I'm just taking some elastics. I have, I guess, three other elastics in her hair that I, and I'm just creating this bubble effect and I like to take different colors because it looks super cute and I just leave the bottom fluffed out I'm doing the same thing to the other side and I, I like this style you know it kind of looks like Pippi Longstocking but <laughs> when you're a kid and you have this style it, it's super adorable so there you have it the last style I hope you found a, a style or two that you'll do in your daughter's hair and I think Sakura has something else she wants to talk to you guys about uh, look at my head by then guys do you see it? Did you like this video?